Data replication is the process of copying data from one location to another to ensure data availability and disaster recovery. Oracle Active Data Guard and Storage Remote Mirroring are two common data replication solutions used in enterprise environments. This video is intended to provide a quick brief as to why Oracle Active Data Guard is preferred to traditional storage disaster recovery technologies. Storage remote mirroring involves copying data from one storage area to another. Data replication occurs at the block level. Storage remote mirroring replicates every write made to data files, redo log files, and control files. Thus, it requires to replicate a higher volume of data than active data card. Storage remote mirroring performs zero Oracle validation. It only performs the physical checksum validation, providing limited isolation between mirrored storage copies. Limited isolation and zero Oracle validation ensures that physical corruption written to primary storage, as well as administrative errors, for example, accidental deletion of data files or log files are replicated to remote storage, making both copies unusable. Storage remote mirroring provides basic data protection and disaster recovery capabilities, but may not offer advanced high availability features such as automatic failover or load balancing. Oracle Active Data Guard is a data replication solution for Oracle databases. Active Data Guard transmits the data either synchronously or asynchronously directly from the SGU, that is, directly from memory. On the receiving side, data is not only received but also applied by an active instance, by an actively running Oracle instance. Data replication occurs at the database level with the primary database continuously replicating only redo transactions to the standby database and not the entire blocks. Thus, only the essential information is replicated to the standby side with a huge reduction in data volume that is sent across the network. This reduces network bandwidth requirements significantly and can reduce the overall network cost. Thus, Oracle database recovery processes performs continuous validation as changes are applied to the standby. This validation uses knowledge of Oracle Redo and data block structures to check for physical data corruptions, logical intra-block corruption, and lost write corruption to ensure the highest level of isolation between primary and standby. Active Data Guard provides a ransomware protection. If the standby only applies data that is unaltered, maliciously altered data it will not be applied to the standby side and therefore the standby database is implicitly protected. Oracle Active Data Guard provides advanced data protection and disaster recovery capabilities including automatic failover, fast start failover and support for multiple standby databases. Oracle Active Data Guard can also be used for read-only, reporting and backups improving database performance and availability. Thus, Oracle Active Data Guard efficiently maintains a physical copy of production and guarantees its integrity. Active Data Guard with maximum availability architecture, best practices can achieve very low end-to-end -end failover timings in seconds. Many storage-based failover solutions will take 30 minutes or longer with the potential of data loss. Kindly refer to this link for more details. Thanks for watching.